Good day, everyone. Today, we will be discussing volume of a cube and rectangular prism using cubic centimeters and cubic meters. Together, let's make learning mathematics fun and easy. In your previous lesson, you have learned to visualize the volume of a cube and a rectangular prism, as well as the use of formula during the application. In this lesson, you are able to visualize the process of finding the volume and derive the formula in solving mathematical problems. Volume of a rectangular prism and a cube Volume is the number of cubic units needed to fill the spatial figure. It is the amount that will occupy space of the figure. Volume is three-dimensional or 3D process of measuring the spatial figure. It is composed of the area of the base, which is the length times width, the height, or volume is length times width times height. That is why every answer in this cubic units. A cube is an example of a special figure that has three dimensions. Since all the faces of the cube are perfect squares, the length, the width, and the height are equal. The sides of the square are also called edges of the cube and S is the symbol used. Thus, the formula to find the volume of the cube is S multiply by s times s or cubic centimeter side is equal to 3 cm volume is 3 cm times 3 cm times 3 cm equals 27 cubic centimeters We know that for a rectangular prism, the base is always a rectangle. Therefore, the area of the base is always the product of length and width. To get the volume, we just multiply the area by height. Volume is length times width times height. 5 cm times 3 cm times 4 cm equals 60 cubic centimeters. Study the figure below and analyze the given unit of measure to find its volume. Volume is equals to length times width times height. 5 cm times 3 cm times 2 cm is equals to 30 cubic centimeters. Volume is equals to base times height. 10 meters times 6 meters times 4 meters is equals to 60 square meters times 4 meters equals 240 cubic meters. Volume is equals to length times speed times height. 3 cm times 3 cm times 3 cm is equals to 27 cubic centimeters. Estimating and using appropriate units of measure for volume. The unit of measurement 
you will use depends on the size of the object you will measure. For tiny objects, it is better to use cubic millimeters. For small ones, we use cent cubic centimeters or decimeters. And for big objects, we use cubic meters. Write the best units of measures to find the volume of the following. Water in a rectangular pool. Cubic meters. An ice before it melts. Cubic centimeters. A dice. Cubic millimeters. A blackboard eraser. Cubic centimeters. Oil in a rectangular box. Cubic decimeter. Let's do this. Find the volume of each prism. Four meters times 2.5 meters times 3.5 meters equals 35 cubic meters. 8 centimeters times 4 centimeters times 5 centimeters equals 160 cubic centimeters. 16.5 centimeters times 12 centimeters times 8 centimeters equals 1,584 cubic centimeters. 7 meters times 2 meters times 4 meters equals 56 cubic meters. 16 centimeters times 7 centimeters times 12 centimeters equals 1,344 cubic centimeters. Let's do this. Find the volume of the following prisms. Volume is equal to side times side times side equals 10 meters times 10 meters times 10 meters equals 1,000 cubic meters. The volume of this shape is volume length times width times height 20 meters times 8 meters times 14 meters equals 2,240 cubic meters. The volume of the shape is length times width times height. 12 cm times 5 cm times 8 cm equals 480 cubic centimeters. The volume of this shape is side times side times side equals 13 cm times 13 cm times 13 cm equals 2,197 cubic centimeters. The volume of this object is length times width times height 8 meters times 4 meters times 3 meters equals 96 cubic meters let's do this write the best unit of measure to find the volume of the following 
choose your answer from the box below. A wooden rectangular chopping board. Cubic centimeters. A container van. Cubic meters. A room air conditioner. Cubic decimeter. A brick of butter. Cubic centimeters. A thick book. Cubic decimeter. A hollow block filled with cement. Cubic decimeters. A soap box. Cubic millimeters. A match box. Cubic millimeters. Wall cabinet. Cubic meters. A lunch box. Cubic centimeters. Let's do this. Apply the appropriate formula to find each volume. Volume is equal to length times width times height. 5 cm times 2 cm times 7 cm equals 70 cubic centimeters. Volume is side times side times side equals 10 cm times 10 cm times 10 cm. Volume is equals to 1000 cubic centimeters. Volume is equals to side times side times side equals 7 cm times 7 cm times 7 cm equals 343 cubic centimeters. Volume is equal to length times width times height. 5 meters times 1 meters times 6 meters equals 30 cubic meters. Length times width times height equals 6 meters times 7 4 meters times 2 meters equals 48 cubic meters. Let's do this. Find three objects in your house that are rectangular prisms or cubes. Measure their length, width, and height using the most appropriate unit, then compute for their volume. Write your solutions in your notebook together with the drawing of the objects. A matchbox. Volume is length times width times height. Equals 4 millimeters times 1 millimeters times 2 millimeters equals 8 cubic millimeters. An air conditioner. Volume is equals to S times S times S equals 15 decimeters times 15 decimeters times 15 decimeters equals 3,375 cubic decimeters. A lunch box. Volume is equals to length times width times height. 
12 cm times 6 cm times 5 cm equals 360 cubic centimeters. Let's do this. Find the volume of the following prism. The volume of this prism is length times width times height equals 9 cm times 3 cm times 5 cm equals 135 cubic centimeters. The volume of this prism is length times width times height equals 15 cm times 2 cm times 2 cm equals 60 cubic centimeters. The vo volume of this prism is side times side times side equals 10.5 cm times 10.5 cm times 10.5 cm equals 1157.62 cubic centimeters. The volume of this prism is side times side times side equals 15 cm times 15 cm times 15 cm equals 3375 cubic centimeters. The volume of this prism is length times width times height. 11 cm times 8 cm times 31 cm is equals to 2728 cubic centimeters. Thank you for watching. Till our next mathematics lesson. Goodbye.